Uh, Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin confirmed uh, that President Biden last week had ordered the Pentagon to pause shipment of big bombs to Israel, including 2,000 pound bombs and 500 pound bombs that were supposed to be headed to Israel. Uh, the, this decision comes as Israel uh, is ramping up its operations in Rafah, which is a, a city in southern Gaza where over a million people, Palestinian people, have massed as the war is going on. Um, Israel has pushed forward uh, with a plan to strike Rafah, even though the Biden administration says that it is too risky and would cost too many innocent Palestinian lives and worsen um, the incredible despair that's already going on in um, the territory if they would move forward with this operation in a really uh, tightly packed, dense urban area. The decision uh, by the pr uh, president comes at a really delicate time uh, for both him and for uh, Prime Minister Netanyahu politically at home. Uh, Netanyahu's facing a lot of pressure uh, from families uh, to come to an agreement on a hostage deal. Uh, and he also is facing pressure from his right to continue forward with this mission uh, to eliminate uh, Hamas as much as possible. Uh, Biden uh, is seeing huge protests on campuses across the country as graduations ramp up, but also as the election season is really starting to heat up. And Biden's hearing it from the right that he's growing wobbly uh, in his support for Israel.